Welcome to the Autodesk ANZ YouTube channel. My name is Samuel McAllister and I am a Senior Technical Sales Specialist for Building Information Modeling. Today's presentation is going to cover how to animate a crane inside of Navisworks. So this can be done inside of Navisworks Simulate and Navisworks Manage. Uh, what we do is we go to the main tab and we fire up our animator tool that you see on the screen here. We create a scene and then we're going to add objects to that scene. So currently we've imported in a crane in two parts. We've created uh, some selection groups for those parts, one being the base of the crane and the other being the crane boom. And we're going to the item tools here and we're moving the rotation gizmo to the center of that crane boom. Now it's really important to do this so when you actually go to animate that object, it's spinning at the right pivot point. You don't want it to be spinning in the set center. You've got to make sure that you take it and drag via the XYZ gizmos. You drag the rotation point to that uh, location which is centered on the axis of the crane. You can do this uh, with numbers as well. You can put in XYZ coordinates if you do the drop down inside of Navisworks, inside of that tab to the translate component. Uh, in this case, we're going to manually move it. Uh, the next thing we want to do is now set up the animation for the crane using the key points. So what you're seeing on the screen in the timeline of the animation component here are two key points from point A to point B and we've set them up to rotate uh, say 360 degrees or 180 degrees. So this is over a duration of say 10 or 20 seconds. We can also turn on uh, the ping pong tool, which allows the crane to go back and forth from point A to point B. So it will go 180 degrees, you turn on the PP, the ping pong tool, and that will allow the crane to go from 180 degrees back to its origin point. And that's how simple it is to create an animation inside of Navisworks using the animator tool.